Chris George's Commonwealth title fight is 15 years in the making. George will go into the bout with Cameron Hammond as the heavy underdog, but that doesn't bother the 27-year-old who has fought from behind his whole life. In a shed on the outskirts of Toowoomba, a champion has been made. This No Frills gym is based on hard work and trust. We agree to disagree sometimes, but we work together, we train together. And um, the title in itself would be incredible. They may not have all the bells and whistles, but it works. Chris has gone 11 and 1 in his professional career, including six knockouts. You got to take it into your own account a little bit, and I find like re I've started like ever since I started the post research and research and and about food and, and nutrition. I don't rely too much on other people's input. Craig Monigal has been in George's corner all the way. Craig's been there since I walked into the PCYC at 11 years old, what's the thing you say? Um, everything I've learned boxing wise has been through Craig. Chris and I have been to, together for a long time. We've worked on different things. We work on the fact that he don't know everything, I don't know everything. Fight after fight, Chris has been given the underdog tag, but he always manages to come through with the goods. First, Ozan Craddock, the undefeated knockout specialist. Then, Kiwi Bowen Morgan, the next big thing in New Zealand boxing. Chris knocked both men out. What I did in the amateurs, you know, that doesn't isn't great, isn't something to be you know, talked about and that's probably what's put me as the underdog in a lot of these fights. A number of big names in the boxing industry aren't giving George a chance. That doesn't bother him one bit. Everyone can predict and have a theory but even I don't know what's going to happen. I've got to get in there, feel it out and, uh, and adapt to what's going on. He's trained the house down and come November 25th, both Monigle and George see things playing out one way. I just train them accordingly. Um, and uh, yes, I do think Chris can knock him out. I hope it ends in by a knockout, and, uh, and I think it will. I think it will, um, but it depends who shows up on the night. Kieran Wagstaff, Win News. After becoming the youngest striker.